Recently, I made a reaction to the song Treaty by Yothu Yundi, and I really enjoyed and appreciated every part of that project, whether it was the video, which really gave, gave a great insight into Aboriginal life in Australia. Uh, it put the Aboriginal people up front and centre in the video. The music itself was fa fascinating. It included some traditional Aboriginal instruments as well, like the didgeridoo. The singer loved his voice, but what I loved even more was the lyrics of the song. Talking about something so serious and I'm not giving another great insight into Aboriginal life, but this time more about their play, how, how their land was encroached on. And in that video, quite a few people asked me to check out this one. It's a singer called Jeffrey Gurumu Yunupingu, and the song is called Wyathu. So enjoy my education about Aboriginal singers from Australia. I never knew anything about this singer, so I googled him. I found out he was also part of Yothu, Yothu Yindu, Yindu at one point. Uh, I found out, sadly, he passed away within the last couple of years, but he was born blind, taught himself to play several different instruments, including a guitar, which he played left-handed, but played a right-handed guitar upside down, which is unbelievable to think about. Uh, and he was part of the Yolingu people of uh, the, the First Nations people of Australia, so can't wait to see this one, and yeah, let's listen and see how it goes. Yeah, you can see him play left-handed there actually, in the middle. His voice is breathtaking. Wow, as I mentioned there, absolutely breathtaking, his voice, as soon as I heard him start to sing, he was making some wonderful sounds with his voice to start, but when he actually came in and started singing, it just, that actually left me a bit speechless, oh, even though he, he I mean, he's, what I love about this again is he's singing in his Aboriginal language. And this just shows you don't actually have to understand the language a singer singing and to just appreciate the beauty of the song and of the voice. Like his voice, I can feel everything he's singing about just through the tone of his voice. He couldn't have any more authenticity than someone singing with his amazing voice and I've talked about things like stage presence on previous reactions, like guys like John Farnham who have stage presence when they 
They like they're all over, very energetic and interacting with the audience. This is a whole different type of stage presence, but he has it in abundance. He's literally sitting there, just singing, playing the guitar, but he's utterly captivating. You can't take your eyes off him. You can't close your ears. You just have to be listening to this. I can feel this man. I can feel this music. It's utterly amazing. This is fantastic. This is what I want to see. This is music that you don't find in like any other country and also has so much more authenticity than any music you can find in the charts today. Let's continue. I'm not going to pause this. I, I didn't want to talk over him during that song. I also don't want to pause too much. So that'll be me. I'll play it till the end. I'll talk a bit more afterwards. guitar so beautifully Is, oh, that is just perfection. What a performer as well. Absolutely love him. His, as I mentioned, his presence, his aura is just so captivating. I mean, first we can just give some appreciation to the whole production there with the other musicians on stage with him. They created something so magical with the way they played the music in the background. You just heard it, like, like you really get like, for me, got transported to another place. I really got like drawn into the music and the performance with those little mu instruments playing in the background. But of course, Jeffrey's voice 
his performance, not just his voice, his guitar playing. It was absolutely wonderful to listen to. I mean, his voice itself is an instrument. Like, his voice... It, it really gives me chills even thinking about that, man. It's, I mean, as I mentioned there, like, you, I don't understand anything he's saying, but I can really feel it. And for this one, which is quite different from the other Aboriginal songs I've seen, which are about their play, as I mentioned, about the negative side, I felt like positivity from this performance. I really felt like uplifted and happy, which is... Quite different from what I'm used to listening to listening to the other Aboriginal music I've listened to, which is quite painful listening to what they went through. Uh, this is very different, and again, another one I just appreciate having had the chance to hear. Uh, an amazing performer, a beautiful, beautiful performance, a beautiful song, and if this is what Aboriginal music's like, I just can't wait to find out more. So tell me what you think about this one. Tell me more about Jeffrey, uh, his life, what you like about him, his songs. And I'll check them out soon. But yeah, thanks for recommending that one.